From the murky waters of the sportsman's paradise, stories emerge. Stories of the generations of people who have shared in the bounties of the land. Stories of communities that have persevered through natural disasters. Stories of the abundance of fish, wildlife, and adventures that create an ecosystem rich in diversity. And from the silted banks of the mighty Mississippi to the soggy marsh bottoms, from the tops of towering pine forests to the depths of the salty gulf, human and animal have shared this fortune for centuries. Enjoy these stories as told by outdoor journalists who travel across our state documenting the adventure, sportsmanship, and heritage that make us Bayou Wild. Hi, and welcome to another edition of Bayou Wild TV. I'm Don Dubuque, along with Martha Spencer. Martha, we've got some very interesting features and some very interesting characters you spend a day on a boat with. One of my favorite places to go fishing in Louisiana is out of Port Fouchon. I love the dynamics of the oil rigs and all the boats, and the fishing is fantastic. Well, we headed down there and went fishing with the Gone Pecan fishing team. Gone Pecan is a phrase that they know well in the bayou, but you may not know what it means. They're gonna tell us what Gone Pecan is and we're gonna go catch some red snapper and some amberjack. Fish a few rodeos and uh, we fish a Friends lumber rodeo a lot. And uh, every year we seem to place first, second, third up in there. Hooked a marlin once and uh, got it to the board. Of course they got off, but it's pretty, pretty wild. I caught other fish and other boats, my boat and everything else, but on the team itself, yellowfin or we caught the wahoo last year. and. We're gonna do the Golden Meadow Fouchon Rodeo and uh, we're gonna do the Fouchon Oilman's Rodeo. Probably the Grand Dolph Tarpon Rodeo too. And if you're pretty good at catching fish, but cooking fish not so much, we got a great feature for you. We have a program in Louisiana called Catch and Cook. We'll show you all about that. All coming up from Morton's Seafood Restaurant and Bar on the banks of the Chifuncta River in Madisonville. The old school way is go back to the camp, light the, light the grease up, batter everything, fry it, and then yeah, you know, pistolets or bread or whatever else. You know, we have seven different ways. I mean, uh, you know, grilled, fried, uh, blackened, uh, and with seven different flavors, I mean, you know, which span the globe. We pretty much thought through the flavors to cover whitefish, tuna, or the most popular species, and everything in between. Closed captioning made possible by CETO.com. Become a member. Here's how I guarantee my crawfish tastes great every time. I use Louisiana Fish Fry brand seafood boil. Why do the pros use Louisiana Fish Fry seafood boil? Because the flavor is so good. It has more garlic, onion, paprika, lemon, and not too much salt. It has much better flavor. Louisiana Fish Fry brand seafood boil. Find the yellow bag, and pour and boil for great crawfish every time. In 1967, Dutch Stagner realized his dream to run his own meat market. Fifty years and three generations later, Double D and the Stagner family still operate with Dutch's original commitment to quality. Pick up some Double D sausage today and share your good times with us on Facebook.
Find out if alternative treatment is the answer to your pet's health issues. Contact Dr. G at VetNaturally.com. Port Fouchon, Louisiana, known globally as one of the top oil and gas ports in the world. But for South Louisianians, it's also known as a launching pad for hundreds of offshore fishing vessels, both recreational and commercial. When heading out of Bell Pass, it doesn't take long to see offshore oil and gas structures peppered across the horizon. These platforms create artificial reef structures that attract not only the fish, but also the fishermen. The offshore boats you'll see come in all sizes, colors, and styles. But there's one that many are familiar with seeing at platforms and way stations simply known as Gone Pecan. Okay, my wife has a bakery named Cajun Pecan House in Cuddle. And I used to fish with a chef from New Orleans. And when I got the boat, he said, what you gonna name it? I said, I don't know. We had just bought the Pecan House. He said, you ought to name it Gone Pecan. I said, that'll stick. Sorry, it means there's no hope for you. You're hopeless. The Gone Pecan fishing team combines offshore fishing passions of brothers, friends, and family. Aboard the vessel, the team works like orchestrated chaos. Rigging, tying hooks and leaders, catching bait, reading winds and currents, everyone assists in deckhand duties. That is everyone except the skipper. Well, I gotta keep them in line, you know, somebody has to stay in charge, but they, they pretty much know what they gotta do. Brent Gitter is the owner of the vessel. Um, I worked for him 20 years ago, just kind of stayed friends. Uh, I'm friends with his son-in-law, and I've always fished offshore. They fished and just kind of met in the middle and started fishing. No matter the target species, the guys of Gone Pecan are driven by their camaraderie. They've learned the fishery together and had a lot of fun in the process. Well, it's seven years we're fishing together and you can't put a price on a good time. You know, friends is, you know, it's not about the competition, it's just spending time with friends and family. Uh, Brent and I's brothers and uh, I fish with them uh, periodically, uh, you know, for the Fouchon Oil Majority, I fish with them and for Golden Meadow Fouchon, we, uh, we fish together. You know, we have the shirts, we have the wrap on the boat and everything else, so it's, they, they know who we are. You know, they, they know who's on the boat, they know who we are, so not to say we're the best, or, you know, we, by far, the best. We don't do anything better than anyone else, but we have fun, you know, it's all family, and we just, we just have fun with it. This offshore fishing passion also comes from generations of family members in the Lafouche area. They were raised with a community lifestyle with ebbs and flows of fishing seasons. Working as a team is not limited to one on the boat. We have six kids and me and wife's been together for going on 14 years now. And it's just family and friends. And like last night we came down and three kids were at one person's house, the other three kids were at another person's house. And you know, so it's always, it's always a juggle. It's always fun. Fish a few rodeos and uh, we fish a do friends lumber rodeo a lot and uh, every year we seem to place first, second, third up in there. Hooked a marlin once and uh, got it to the boat. Of course it got off but pretty, 
pretty wild. I caught other fish and other boats, my boat and everything else, but on the team itself, yellowfin or we caught the wahoo last year and gonna do the golden meta push on rodeo and uh, we're gonna do the push on oilman's rodeo. Call it grand off top and rodeo too. It's like everybody knows each other. So we you know we, we trust each other, we visit, we hang out at the, each other's camp and everything else, you know, every, every weekend. You know, we usually we start coming down for Easter weekend until Labor Day. So every weekend we're here at our camp, the neighbor's camp, three camps down, two streets over. And this year during the 4th of July weekend, you can find Gone Pecan as well as hundreds of other passionate anglers at the annual Golden Meadow Fushan Tarpon Rodeo at Moran's Marina. It used to be at the junior high school in Golden Meadow many, many years ago when I was a young child. And uh, Port Fouchon got involved and busy and it grew and they had the public boat launch and uh, they moved the rodeo to the boat launch in Fouchon and they named it the Golden Meadow Fouchon Tarpon Rodeo. And it's been at Fouchon ever since. So this year is our 70th annual Golden Meadow Fouchon Tarpon Rodeo. Going to be held July 5th through the 7th at Moran's Marina. Uh, new for this year in 2018, we're adding swordfish to the Blue Water Division. Uh, the other new thing we we're happy to announce is that we wanted to bring more kids activities. So this year we have Game on Wheels, which is basically an 18-wheeler, uh, self-contained air-conditioned, multiple flat-screen TVs, latest games from Xbox, PlayStation, and Wii uh, for kids to play. can handle up to 28 kids at one time. It'll be available the entire weekend at the rodeo for kids to have something to, extra to do at the rodeo this year. It's family friendly. Uh, we use a lot of organizations from the schools to come in and put up food booths where they can uh, do service hours. The, the children can create service hours and, and also get the, uh, the funds. And um, this year we're gonna have uh, mobile uh, uh, entertainment for the children. Uh, the children, uh, uh, the kids get fishing poles every year and for free. You know, if they buy a rodeo ticket, they get a fishing pole, which is, which is a good gift. So a ticket includes, uh, adult ticket is $35, a children's ticket is $20. Uh, on an adult ticket, it includes a ditty bag, and it also includes a shrimp ball dinner on the uh, Saturday afternoon, evening of the rodeo. So to find out more information about the rodeo, you can look, look us up at fouchontarpin.com. You can also like us on Facebook and follow us on Instagram. Hi, I'm Donnie Rouse. There are a lot of different reasons to shop at Rouse's. It's the people. Everybody that works here is just so nice. Our stores get deliveries seven days a week. They have such a wide variety at Rouse's. Everything's in stock. I mean, everything. We use Rouse family recipes and ingredients found right here in the store. It's the food. Rouse's food tastes like homemade. And they're local. Like us. We also have great prices. That's the difference Rouse's makes. Several other states have done this in the past. We have something that most other states don't have. This is sportsman paradise. We have some of the best fishing in the entire world right here. But what we have that the rest of the states don't have, we have some of the best restaurants in the entire world. For us in the restaurant, you know, the perspective is it's an amazing program. It really is. It gives the chefs an opportunity to really get the freshest ingredients. Not that we don't have the world's greatest seafood down here already, but right out of the water to the restaurant, no place in the world can you do that. We love it. In 1967, Dutch Stagner realized his dream to run his own meat market. Fifty years and three generations later, Double D and the Stagner family still operate with Dutch's original commitment to quality. Pick up some Double D sausage today and share your good times with us on Facebook. Here's how I guarantee my crawfish tastes great every time. I use what the pros use. I use Louisiana Fish Fry brand seafood boil. Why do the pros use Louisiana Fish Fry seafood boil? Because, guys, it has more herbs and spices. It has a much better flavor. It's easy. Just pour and boil. Louisiana Fish Fry brand seafood boil. Find the yellow bag, pour and boil for great crawfish every time. Summertime in the northern Gulf of Mexico typically means one will target amberjack and red snapper when the seasons are open. Oh, come on. I don't know if he's going to make it. 
This trip with Gone Pecan Fishing Team fell on the last day of the early amberjack season and also within the first week of the 2018 red snapper season, which in recent years provided a rare opportunity to target both species in the same day. The bait of choice for many anglers when fishing for large amberjack are hardtails. A fishing day typically starts with shallow digging around oil platforms to catch these feisty bait fish. Many times an angler will catch multiple hardtails on a single drop. Once bait wells are stocked, it's time to head for deeper waters. Pound for pound, many anglers say that a great amberjack is one of the strongest fighting offshore fish. It's no doubt that that's how they were dubbed the reef donkey. If you want to fish for amberjack, one thing's for certain. Prepare to use every muscle in your body and mentally prepare for a roller coaster of emotions. Amberjack hits the deck of the boat, there's always a sigh of relief, followed by a true sense of accomplishment, perhaps even joy. <laughs> but on the other side of the coin, stressing every leg, arm, and back muscle only to have a line break can be a bit frustrating. <laughs> A successful day reeling in an amberjack is a great ending to the final day of the 2018 May season. If they want to target these species again, the Gone Pecan fishing team will have to wait until the season reopens on August 1st. But among similar fishing techniques to amberjack, an angler can easily fill their quota of red snapper. Red snapper are plentiful and readily available when fishing rigs or bottom structure. It doesn't take long to reel up the first two person quota for dropping for red snapper. Twenty eighteen recreational red snapper anglers began catching these species when the season opened on May twenty fifth, and the season this year is based on harvest data. Louisiana Department of Wildlife and Fisheries Law Creole data estimated that after the first two weeks of the snapper season, 22% of the quota was met for 2018. This could mean that the season may not last for the duration of the summer. For the Gone Pecan fishing team, snapper fishing this day was easy and the boat's limit was reached in just a few hours. Here's how I guarantee my crawfish tastes great every time. I use Louisiana Fish Fry brand seafood boil. Why do the pros use Louisiana Fish Fry seafood boil? Because the flavor is so good. It has more garlic, onion, paprika, lemon, and not too much salt. It has much better flavor. Louisiana Fish Fry brand seafood boil. Find the yellow bag, and pour and boil for great crawfish every time. In 1967, Dutch Stagner realized his dream to run his own meat market. Fifty years and three generations later, Double D and the Stagner family still operate with Dutch's original commitment to quality. Pick up some Double D sausage today and share your good times with us on Facebook. 
If you hunt or fish, you really need to check out 20echo.com. It's an app that you can take on the water or on the hunt. It logs all the information. It's got the date, the GPS location, tons of information to log your catch or kill. It's a great thing to have. Check it out at 20echo.com and you'll see it more on Bayou Wild TV. Here's how I guarantee my crawfish tastes great every time. I use Louisiana Fish Fry brand seafood boil. Why do the pros use Louisiana Fish Fry Seafood Boil? Because the flavor is so good. Louisiana Fish Fry Seafood Boil has more garlic, onion, paprika, lemon, and not too much salt. Louisiana Fish Fry brand Seafood Boil. Find the yellow bag, and pour and boil for great crawfish every time. It's no secret that fishing and cooking in Louisiana go hand in hand. And perhaps one of the best ways to enjoy Louisiana seafood is freshly cooked. All right, great day of fishing. And now that the catching's over, it's time for the hard work. Thanks to the Louisiana Catch and Cook program, recreational anglers can enjoy their own caught fish prepared by some of the state's most creative chefs. Several other states have done this in the past. We have something that most other states don't have. This is sportsman paradise. We have some of the best fishing in the entire world right here. But what we have that the rest of the states don't have, we have some of the best restaurants in the entire world. For us in the restaurant, you know, the perspective is it's an amazing program, it really is. It gives the chefs an opportunity to really get the freshest ingredients. Not that we don't have the world's greatest seafood down here already, but right out of the water to the restaurant, no place in the world can really do that. We love it. From our perspective as a charter business, we know we have a world-class fisheries. And we have a lot of creative chefs out here, but when you come to the Bourbon House and some of the best chefs on the planet cooks the fish that was on your line at 10 a.m. and it's on your dish at 6 p.m., you now have some world-class dishes and recipes. It just makes our resource even better. The Catch to Cook program allows a permitted restaurant to cook fish supplied by a recreational angler. A growing list of participating restaurants can be found online on the Louisiana Department of Wildlife and Fisheries website. It's an interesting and intriguing opportunity to cross promote uh, between two great things in Louisiana. One is our, you know, our, our sportsman's paradise and, and the amount of fish that are out there. Uh, the other are great Louisiana restaurants. If you're in the Fouchon area, C. Moran's Restaurant offers a way for anglers to personalize their catch and cook menu choices. We just had a great day offshore in Port Fouchon, but now we've got our cleaned fish and we're really hungry. In Louisiana, if you have a state permit at your restaurant, you can actually legally take your catch and have it cooked for you. And that's why we're here at C. Moran's Restaurant in Port Fouchon, where we're going to cook this Almaco Jack. Hey, Basically, we need a, your fish clean, boneless, and skin on, skin off is up to you if you want it prepared that way. But whatever way you would want it prepared when you come in, we need it that way. Um, there's a, when they come in, just come in with a bag and uh, let them know you have cooked your catch. They'll have a little form that the state provides for us, wildlife fisheries, they fill out. It's, it's just explains the liabilities and things like that. And uh, you sign off on it. Um, you go ahead and have a seat. They'll send you the menu. There's uh, three different seasonings, seven different ways to prepare the fish, and there's a slew of add-ons, and it comes with two, whatever our sig two signature uh, sides are for that week. You may be just looking for new ways to prepare fish at home, or you don't feel like making a mess in your own kitchen. You can still enjoy the fish you caught, freshly prepared and cooked. You can call, let them know, hey, I got a party on four coming, but cook your catch. Kind of puts them on notice and uh, to prepare for it. Most restaurants, you're limited to grouper, snapper, the things that are provided for by food service entities. Whereas here, you're fishing Timbler Island, you look up and catch four pompano, okay, which are showing up over there. You bring your pompano in and cook it. Whereas to have pompano, you almost have to go to an August or a TD fans or something like that, make a special trip. It allows you to cook whatever. Like today we're doing garlic butter, almaco, and uh, that was something y'all caught today on the boat. And whether you're on Bourbon Street or down the bayou, your freshly caught fish is prepared as something you can order in a five-star restaurant. 
Well, the Charter Association is very, very excited about this happening. It gives them another dimension that they can add and market in their charters. It also gives the, the Louisiana anglers, whether they're from in-state or out-of-state, uh, another avenue for them to, uh, to enjoy Louisiana. And that's, and at the end of the day, that's what it's about. We find a lot of folks coming in from California, from New York. Uh, we do participate with a lot of locals as well, but it's, it's, it's a lot of, uh, you know, tourists. And it's, it's exciting to see their face. They come in because they've been on the water all day. They got to experience our amazing natural resources. And then they get to take that amazing seafood, that fish they caught that day, and bring it to some of the best restaurants in the world and watch it prepared right in front of them. The old school way is go back to the camp, light the, light the grease up, batter everything, fry it, and then yeah, you know, pistolets or bread or whatever else. You know, we have seven different ways. I mean, uh, you know, grilled, fried, uh, blackened, uh, and with seven different flavors, I mean. You know, which span the globe. We pretty much thought through the flavors to cover whitefish, tuna, or the most popular species, and everything in between. The cook and catch menu at Sea Moran's or the other restaurants participating in Louisiana's Catch and Cook program can leave you with more time to enjoy family, friends, and your food in Louisiana. So this Almaco Jack was swimming about four hours ago. We caught it, cleaned it, brought it to Sea Moran's restaurant, and they cooked it way better than I ever could. Hi, I'm Donnie Rouse. There are a lot of different reasons to shop at Rouse's. It's the people. Everybody that works here is just so nice. Our stores get delivery seven days a week. They have such a wide variety at Rouse's. Everything's in stock. I mean, everything. We use Rouse family recipes and ingredients found right here in the store. It's the food. Rouse's food tastes like homemade. And they're local. Like us. We also have great prices. That's the difference Rouse's makes. Here's how I guarantee my crawfish tastes great every time. I use what the pros use. I use Louisiana Fish Fry brand seafood boil. Why do the pros use Louisiana Fish Fry seafood boil? Because, guys, it has more herbs and spices. It has a much better flavor. It's easy, just pour and boil. Louisiana Fish Fry brand seafood boil. Find the yellow bag, pour and boil for great crawfish every time. Thank you for watching Bayou Wild today. Coming up next week, we're going frogging. Can't wait. <laughs> it's so much fun. I just started doing this. It's been something I've been wanting to do in Louisiana for years. There is no age gap for this. It's a lot of fun. We got little kids, adults. You're going to see some frogging. Then we're going to head down to Crawfish Haven. That's the place where we, you saw a few months back we did our crawfishing excursion. But we're going to go cook up some frog legs and some more delicious treats coming out of Mrs. Rose's bed and breakfast. All right, and don't forget, come have lunch with us at Morton's. We call it Mondays at Morton's. We get here about 11 o'clock. Check the schedule or contact them here at Morton's for the dates we'll be here. Come talk a little fishing with us and have a great meal. And also follow us on social media. We've got an active Facebook page. We're pushing for 2,000 followers. And once we hit that, we're doing a great giveaway from Pork Mafia. You can also check us out on Instagram and YouTube where all of our episodes are in full length. And we'll see you next week with another edition of Bayou Wild TV.